Well, hey everyone, it's Dragon Otaku here, and today I'm reacting to The Princess Principle Episode 6. Now, uh, I normally get these out the day they air, but I got nailed with post-anime depression pretty bad <laughs> this weekend. I was having a hard time bringing myself to watch anything else, so I do apologize. But most of you have probably been there, I imagine, at some point or another. I don't normally get hit with it real bad, but... This time I did. I got nailed hard. <laughs> but I, I'm feeling better now. So uh, we're going to start this off here in three, two, one. Good training. <laughs> <laughs> Good practice, though. We're we going to get a Dorothy flashback. Love this OP. I will never be deceived. I will never die through lies. Case eighteen. So it's the furthest in the timeline we've been. That's true. Okay.
those streets. <laughs> Damn. Mm. Well, then that makes sense. <laughs> I recognize that voice. <laughs> She does not look happy to be there. Too stubborn to die. <laughs> Sad, but true. Especially in times like this. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, damn.
<laughs> She's gonna knock your ass out. <laughs> uh huh. No, you're being a bully, man. If she wasn't mad before, now she's fucking furious at your ass. <sighs> Jesus, dude. You're a fucking mess. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God, though, man. <laughs> That's fucking rough right there.
Okay. Typically, yeah. Don't make me hate you more, buddy. Don't be too obvious. <sighs> That's clever as fuck, though. I won't be surprised if they just killed his ass. He's gonna push it and they're gonna kill you. Yeah. Oh, he sold her out.
You son of a bitch. You're all dead, or at least injured severely. <laughs> this music score. <sighs> <laughs> I ain't gonna do shit. Ooh. Okay, okay. Okay, so he didn't sell her out. <sighs> okay. Still pissed at him, though, because the abusive fuckwad. I mean, I get why people get like that, but still, you know, there's no excuse for it. He's going to die. Jesus. I feel bad for her, though, but I can't feel bad for him. <sighs> Good taste. Yep. She said it right there. What a depressing ass episode. <sighs> depressing as fuck. I mean, I get why people get like that. You know, when you passionate about something and you love it and you're good at it and then it gets stripped away and you're unable to do it anymore, you know, and your life spirals down. But man... As a dad.
it's unforgivable, man, to see someone beating the shit out of their kid like that. <sighs> you know, a- as a father of two, man, can't even fucking imagine it, you know, getting to that point. No matter how broken you are, there's no excuse for that. And, you know, um, of course she still loves him. He's her dad, you know? (sighs) So, you know, it doesn't matter, you know... I feel bad for her, you know. I feel bad for her. <sighs> Depressing ass episode. <laughs> will bring up a lot of complex feelings, you know. I'm the type to generally try to sympathize with a lot of people. You know, broken people and other actions and stuff. and But yeah, like I said, it's a very complex episode of a lot. <laughs> made, bring up a lot of complex feelings on me. Alright, well this is Drunk on a Taco. I'm heading out for now. Please like and subscribe and I will talk to you all later.